Electronic funds transfer, ENFT in short, provides a solid base to automate the payment process. Using SFTP, Secure File Transfer Protocol, with EFT processing offers additional advantages in terms of security, compliance and efficiency. SFTP is a secure and encrypted protocol that ensures the confidentiality and integrity of data during file transfers. And this is one of the main reasons why people use it. With EFT processing for Sage 300, you can automate the SFTP transfer of the file by configuring the details in EFT Bank. When you create an EFT file, the file is automatically uploaded to the SFTP site. This is documented in the help for EFT that we're currently looking at. And this is what I'm now going to demonstrate. I'm now in Orchid's EFT processing. I have created an AP payment batch and I want to generate the file and upload the EFT file to the bank's FTP site. I'm going to select the batch, enter a description. When I create, EFT is generating the file and uploading it to the FTP site. In this example, I don't have access to a bank site, but my own FTP server that I've connected to. I'm using FileZilla instead of the banking software to show you that the file has been uploaded. Refresh and that is today's file. If I go and create another file, EFT will create the file, upload it to the bank, go back to FileZilla, refresh and see that a new file has been uploaded. So you can see I have named the file in a way that is unique based on the date of the upload and a unique daily run number. And this is all configured in EFT Bank. I'm going to show you quickly the setup. Most of what you're familiar with in EFT processing is configured the same way whether you use SFTP or other output destination. We have different options to connect and that should cater for most of the banking um, bank site requirements. You can configure how, the name, how to name the file depending on the bank's requirement. In this case, we use the creation date and a run number that is reset every day to make the file unique. And of course, you still have access to all the file types that are available in EFT. This is all documented uh, in the help. And many banks actually provide access to an SFTP server. So this is an option that you should discuss with your bank.